Hey friends, I'm Shelly Shush. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is all about toddler lunch ideas. If you are new to my channel, I have a almost three-year-old daughter named Luna, and I am a work-from-home mom, and I also have a three-month-old infant son. His name is Maverick. So I'm going to be sharing with you guys a week's worth of toddler lunch ideas. My daughter is not picky at all when it comes to foods. She's pretty much always eaten everything since she was like four months old. So I've always tried to give her new foods, different types of foods, culturally different foods, and she has taken to pretty much everything. So we mix it up quite a bit at lunch, and these are pretty healthy meal ideas for you. So if you need some inspiration for your toddler meal ideas, then just keep watching. Okay, so our first lunch of the week is going to be some cucumbers and some broccoli. I asked her which one she wanted and she said both. And then I have a little bit of rotisserie chicken and then this organic rosemary and sea salt cracker. And then a little bit of spinach dip over here on the side as well. She can dip all of the things into it. Uh, I think this one's going to go over pretty well. Okay, don't mind the screaming baby in the back. He's ready for his lunch too. So to make it just a little bit more festive, I added a festive napkin and then one of these little heart picks. They're just cupcake toppers. It makes it a little more fun for them to eat. And then of course she's got her festive Valentine's Day cup as well. You getting ready to eat? Yeah? All right. Go get it, girl. So in this one, I just have some sliced cheese, a little love marshmallow, some pepperoni, cucumber, which is one of Luna's favorites, some Annie's cheese crackers, and then some fried onions. The kid loves fried onions. And then I'm giving her one of these juice boxes. It's mostly water with a hint of juice. And if you guys can see, it has, oh, let's focus on here. It has only two grams of sugar in it. So it's a win for moms. And I have your already. Every time I make Luna mac and cheese for lunch, I always make broccoli with it because I feel like they just go well together. So I buy the frozen broccoli so it's easy for lunches. And then I just heat it up in the microwave for one minute with a little bit of water. And then when it comes out, I'll just put a little shaving of butter on it. And then I'll take my Himalayan salt right here and I'll just grate a little bit of salt on top of it for her. All right, so lunch today is macaroni and cheese with, uh, well, it's the Annie's mac and cheese with frozen broccoli that I warmed up in the microwave like I showed you guys and a piece of a red pepper. Usually I would do like a fruit and a vegetable or like a vegetable and like a treat. Mm -hmm. But because we had brownies this morning, we baked brownies and she already had one, I decided I'll give her two vegetables instead. All right, and she's just gonna have some water with her lunch and watch her tablet. What are you gonna watch today? Gabby's Funhouse? Yeah. Okay. So I'm not sure if I showed what she's eaten out of all the other meals that I've put in this video so far, but I decided I'll show you guys the aftermath of her lunch. Uh, she ate everything except for her red pepper. She actually didn't even touch her red pepper. I find that she really likes them more as like a snack than she does with part of her meal. So maybe I'll just save it and I'll try to give it to her when she wakes up from her nap. So today's lunch, uh, Luna's having some canned tuna with mayo, some peas and carrots. We have like an assortment of crackers that I use for charcuterie, so she chose the four crackers that she wanted, and then I gave her some cheese as well. And we are gonna sit at the table and have lunch together. Good. Yeah, is that one good? I Yeah. Cheese first, huh? All right, yum. So we've already re-upped on the cheese. So she had four little squares of cheese and now she's asking for more peas and carrots. So I'm just gonna add some more for her. And she ate all of her tuna and half a cracker so far. And here is the final aftermath of her lunch. That's her third helping of peas and carrots. She didn't quite make it through this one though, but uh, she didn't really go for the crackers either, but I'm glad because she got lots of protein in. All right, Luna's lunch today is going to be in 
a bento box because we are headed out to a friend's house and I'm gonna bring her lunch with us. So she has a turkey and cheese sandwich. It has mustard on one side, mayo on the other side, marbled cheese and just some uh, sliced turkey. And then she has some strawberries and grapes. I asked her which one she wanted and she said both. We've got some yogurt raisins in the middle here and then these are just some tiny little mini dill pickles. She loves pickles. My family is a pickle family and she's never had these tiny ones before so I hope she's going to like them. And then I just put a little pick. I like to do that when I cut up fruit for her so that it's easier for her to grab and it makes it more fun for her to eat and it also keeps her hands a little less dirty. So this is what's left of her lunch. I'm not sure why she always asks me for grapes when she never eats them. She only ate the strawberries. She loved the pickles and of course the yogurt raisins. And she picked through the sandwich. I mean, she didn't eat it all, but she ate a good portion of it. I'm fine with whatever she eats out of her food. If it's more than half, then I'll save it for like a snack after her nap. But this is perfectly fine. She also had a, quite a bit of snacks too. That's it for this video today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please let me know if there are any other types of toddler videos that you are wanting to see me make for my channel. I am trying to grow my mom community on here and I want to make videos that you guys want to watch. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are new around here. You can follow me over on Instagram at mrs.shelly.shoosh and I will catch up with you soon in a new video. Bye!